to Everett now. A hazmat team blocked off a neighborhood after reports of someone throwing away chemicals around the city. Chemicals used to make drugs. NBC 10's Michael Rosenfield is joining us live there tonight with the full details. Michael. Glenn, investigators have been here pretty much all day and they're expected to be here for several more hours. Tonight, the street behind me here in this neighborhood is still closed down as they try to remove chemicals from a home. A street sealed off all day as state hazmat teams go in and out of a home on Gled Hill Avenue. City officials say the investigation began after someone reported a person disposing chemicals related to the manufacturing of illicit narcotics at multiple locations around the city. That brought the fire department, police, and the hazmat team to the home. I feel a little worried because, you know, my friends live down the street, super worried about it. I hope everything comes out okay, nobody's hurt. Crews have been removing chemicals from the house, a process that stretched for hours. The state's Department of Fire Services says crews are dealing with unknown and potentially hazardous substances. The goal to identify and mitigate anything dangerous. If anything explodes, everybody around here would have to evacuate. Authorities say there is no threat to the public, but the scene is just about a block away from Everett High School, and students were told to avoid the area at dismissal time. Yeah, Investigators say they will notify neighbors when the house has been cleared. A little scary because I've only seen this on TV. I've never seen it in person. So it's a very scary thing, but I have, I have trust in the guys that are working right now. I have trust in them. I know the professionals. I know we're going to be safe. Police haven't said if any arrests have been made or if anybody could possibly be facing any charges. Ivan Everett tonight, Michael Rosenfield, NBC10 Boston.